girl. Ziggy, ziggy, I fuck up my whole world. Pause when she talk nothing like old girl. Scary and sporty. Tell her what I want, what I really, really want is a spice. Hey, it's Shamar, and if you're wondering why I have on the same shirt that I did last video, well, it's not because I'm dirty, not because I'm clean, not because I kissed the boy behind the magazine, but no, it's really because it's the same night. It's currently 1.23 in the morning. And now that I wash my hair, I still have to do it. But when I first start off, I always just use this, this oil. And I just put it all over. And I really love the way that smells. It smells so good. All right. This is almost gone, but this is what I like to use as my leave-in. And I know people said like it has alcohol in it and alcohol dries out your hair, blah, 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 but it works perfectly fine for me. I actually need some more. And I like how thick it is because I feel like non-thick products just don't make my hair stay as moisturized longer, as long. And real good. Then I just detangle. And then I use this curl activator as a moisturizer from Lotta Body, which also smells really good. And it's super thick. I feel like, only thing I don't like about this is I feel like it takes much longer for my, for my hair to dry with this. So I try not to use too much. I originally was using the Cantu's curl activator, but I lost it. And then I seen this one and it was way cheaper, so I went ahead and bought that. And then just twist it whichever direction you want. <sighs> and then you just, oh, I feel like it's so hard to show. Maybe if I turn around, you can see. Hopefully I'm in frame. And you just twist at the bottom. When I get to the front, it will be much easier to show. And just tuck the end. Some people use bobby pins to secure the ends, but I don't. What I skipped last time, I like my little ho -o wheel, ho -ho -ho wheel. I like to put that on there to top it off. And just do the same thing. Once I get to the front, you will be able to see it much better. And then I get close so you guys can actually see. All right, so I like to twist this way. So you just twist. Don't twist like too tight or else your head will be hurting. And usually when I got like this much, that's when I'll start twisting it actually down. And you see, you have to like get it under, twist it underneath and not twist it above. And you see how I'm wrapping it under? Boom. And 
not savage. I can't let this bad. song Google play the next song Google Google hey Google play the next song she's so hard-headed I guess I didn't say hey Google but it's still her fault oh yes last one We're done. Hello, I am back. And it's the next day. It's now 7.30. So I'm going to go ahead and unwrap these. Hopefully they turned out nice. <clears throat> but first I'm going to throw some oil on my fingers. On my hands. Fingers. And you just twist them in the opposite direction that you originally twisted. Oh, it still feel a little wet. Dang it. Oh well, I have somewhere to go. So Naturally separate. Uh, I think I might grab my blow dryer and just blow dry the roots. So we'll see how it looks once it's all. It's this last one. Oh, this is so wet and so salty. Okay, let me. Go grab my blow dryer and I'll be right back. So I couldn't find my regular blow dryer. So I have to use this Revlon brush dryer. And I'm gonna put it on. Put the top part half up and we'll updo with two little puffs up top. Touch my 
This is it. Yeah, I like the way this looks much better than what I had going on before. Alright, so seriously this time. Thanks for watching. I hope you watch my next video that I post. And don't forget to watch the last video of me dyeing my hair. I wish you nothing but good luck and blessings. Have a nice night.